hello guys last session we saw what is the ref parameter in a c-sharp so today we're going to see what is the out parameter uh, in a c-sharp so ref uh, parameter is like a reference uh, we initialize uh, the variable int i and what i did is i summed summed up but i didn't uh, do any return type but uh, i got the result uh, with the updated uh, value so today uh, we going to see uh, output parameter so uh, in the word only we came to know that it's a uh, it give you the result output so here i going to change a little bit this is the code that written for uh, ref but so for this uh, time uh, i am just uh, modifying this so uh, for reference parameter you should initialize some uh, value but for out we no need to initialize because it's output parameter so i just declare as uh, int and the variable okay and here i i going to change that uh, to out so now uh, it will throws the error so so only i can uh, return the output so i equal to 1 i just assigned it okay so now okay it will throws the error because uh, there is no initialized variable so i'll remove this okay so now instead of ref i'm using uh, out okay so let's remove all the conditions so what i did is i declared the variable without any um, initialization uh, value okay so uh, in my uh, method i uh, add mm, i declared the type called out so if i declare in this parameter so it will um, uh, consider this uh, int one is a i is a output parameter and this value globally written over here so this is what here okay after method okay fine uh, so i declare the variable so I call this method so method uh, you it will uh, uh, go and assign the value for the out and yes you know need to return the output the same like reference so uh, you will get the result as one so let's go and run this make sure that we are getting the same output so if you are not know what is the ref parameter just go through my previous video you get to know that what is that okay so initialized i as so a default uh, point is zero okay so now it's so now currently i is zero now the i is one the so same thing it will because we mentioned as out so output parameter so then yes so now i contains one after the method returns as one oh yeah so this is the way if you want to return any values so you can go ahead and use uh, in the parameter uh, tell that this is the out parameter just uh, send the output here so uh, and then i can take it so hopes you understand if you have any doubt queries uh, please comment us please subscribe our channel if you not subscribed before if you like my video please like